<laughs> Took you a while. I've been waiting out here in the cold all day. They say it's always autumn in Ryham, but right now, it's more like winter. It's said that Merlin's ward has long protected Ryham. It's the only reason that people can actually live here. But recently, Ryham's been getting colder. It's almost snowed the past few days. We've come with the Magistar to investigate this change in weather. My apologies, Miss Hamster. I never got your name. Yes, we should be introduced. You are Valen. I am Hammy. Are all your familiars hamsters? Nope. Chippy told me that General Hogan ordered you to protect the Magister. You must know that serving the Magister is an honor, but it's not easy. I'll be observing you. I hope you'll become a competent retainer. Apologies again, but I have to correct you. I'm a knight, not someone's retainer. Protecting him is just my current task. It's not a lifelong post. Unless your Magister is someone like the Great Merlin, then I may consider it. Did I hear that right? Well, the Magister, he is Mer- Ouch! Why did you just step on my foot, Hammy? Oh, sorry. Chippy likes to spout nonsense. Don't mind him, Mr. Valen. Once you spend some time together, you'll realize that although the Magister isn't Merlin, he is just as powerful. You'll see that he is practically the same as Merlin, except for the different appearance and name. Okay, I'll just wait and see. We should get going. I really want to get to Hollistone as soon as possible. I need a hot drink to help me warm up. Dura above. I really hope the General doesn't give me another assignment. General has asked me to protect you. Not that you need it. A little progress is better than no progress, right?
Just as I expected. Just as I expected. Great. You seem to have pulled yourself together. I was really worried when you passed out. So, how are you getting along with Valen? I hope he hasn't offended you already. Really? That guy's usually a handful. That's not fair, General. These two little hamsters were watching my every move. 
I didn't slack off at all. Wow. Considering you helped us fight all the way here, I'll score your performance on the Magister's behalf. 80 out of 100! Keep up the good work, Mr. Valen! Yes, of course. Thanks for your encouragement, Hammy. Let me say this again, Valen. He was sent by me specifically to look into the changing weather. To ensure success, you must spare no effort in assisting him. Furthermore... You must ensure his safety. I totally understand, General. Ah, <sighs> Valen is my most trusted knight, both in strength and in character. His only shortcoming is probably his big mouth. Anyway, please teach this young man a thing or two during your time together. You can be as strict as you need to be. Stop teasing me, General. We should get down to business. The fire at Ryham was clearly arson. Yes, the young master of the Mithril Consortium identified the culprit as the Scarlet Sorceress. Rowan believes that she was the one who summoned those fire elementals. The Scarlet Sorceress, however, denies it all. I questioned the Scarlet Sorceress before you arrived. I asked her what her reasons were for coming to Ryham, but she didn't say a word. What about you? Do you think the Scarlet Sorceress is the culprit? As it happens, the Scarlet Sorceress did say something. Just one thing. But it made me think. She said that you'd exonerate her. She seemed convinced that you would find the real culprit of the fire. You and her. I don't mean to pry. Uh, but is she an acquaintance of yours? True, you have lost your memory. Some things you might not be able to recall. Don't worry, we'll get to the bottom of all of this in our investigation. Oh, right. Uh, this is your first time in Hollistone, isn't it? Before troubling yourself with the investigation, you might as well take a tour around the village. I suspect you'll like it here. <laughs> Go, have a look around, then come find me. I'll be waiting for you here.